Well, I'll do that, John. Salute to Mondo. I'm over in Starfield. Now, I've gone back to Jemison, and I've sold pretty much everything I freaking own, and I'm upgrading my Starship. I've added in an extra hab, and I'm now putting on some extra storage, and I've put on some extra engines. So let's uh, jump on over. Hopefully, you're going to see the final finishing touches to this. So here you go. I've got a cargo thing that I'm going to stick on the side here. Hopefully. And boom. I want to put it there. It's not letting me. Why wouldn't it let me put it there either? That sucks. Oh, it's probably because I need to flip it. There we go. Now it go there. Excellent day. Now it's coming up to say that there's an error now though. Oh no, that's because I just hadn't attached it. Right, I'm going to put on one more of those on the opposite side because I like things to be symmetrical. Uh, dun, dun, dun. Oh, when I say I put it on the opposite side to make it symmetrical, there's a shield there. So you know what? I'll just get this one on this side and move that back a bit. So we get that, and we'll stick it there. Chicka pow pow, chicka boom boom. Now it says that there's a warning. Let's see what that warning is exactly. Reduce mass, add engines to improve mobility. Can I actually afford to put more engines on this dang thing? All right, well, I've, I've already added these engines up at the top there. I've just added them on. I don't know whether it's going to look good if I add any more engines onto this dang thing. All right, um, I suppose I could. We could give it a go. Uh, let's have a look then. Engines, 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 engines. I mean, technically, what I could do is delete those engines and go for something a little bit more expensive. But they're the most expensive engines on there. Hmm. Let's see if we can just get another set on here somehow. Uh, would they go there? No, I don't know whether I can actually attach it to anywhere else. I've got nowhere to put engines on the back of it. All right, okay, well, we'll delete that then. Okay, so whatever engines are there, there's... I have gone and picked up the most... Ex oh, hold on. That's expensive. White Dwarf. We've already got those on. Yeah, that, that adds to the mass, though, doesn't it, as well? All right, well, we've got these little engines... I don't think there's anywhere I can put them. Hmm. Okay, I might have to give this a bit of a rethink, people. Give me five minutes, I'll be back with you. Well, chums, there you go. Well, I think I've managed to get it to work. And the way I did it was to upgrade these engines to the next ones up from what I actually had. And I've also improved the grav drive, and I snuck some engines in between the grav drive and my reactor. So yeah, and we've got an extra fuel canister there, extra fuel canister there, we've got lots of cargo. Yeah, 900 cargo. I think this is quite optimal now, and I can get in a few more crew now. So yeah, I've got a max crew of two at the moment. But yeah, I put in a hab. I would have thought that would have helped a little bit more with the old crew. But you know what? That will freaking do, people. That'll do. I'm quite happy with that. So yeah, that's that. Done. All good. Okay, how do I exit this now? Exits. Yes, confirmation. A, accept. Heck yes. Boom. There we go, people. We've now got an improved ship. I guess we do, with lots of additional cargo space. So yeah, I've sold off pretty much all my resource, apart from some adaptive frame. I might go and fly to my actual outpost and see if I can put in some storage there. Might as well just do an episode of improvement gains. Yeah, why the fudge not? So now it's got an extra floor. Let's go and have a little tour of my extra floor, people. Yeah, let's head on in. I might be able to decorate it or something, put in some workbenches. But then again, that's kind of what I'm going to use outposts for. Or I can just use the lodge for that. Okay, so yeah, we've got... Well, look, we've got an extra floor now. We've got a ladder going up. Okay, well, let's, um, let's go on up. Let's have a little look what's up there, shall we, people? Probably not much, to be honest. It's just an extra crew quarters, I think. Yeah, so there's an extra bed up here for somebody. Yeah, just an extra crew quarters. So there we go. All good. Yeah, got an extra one of these in here. I don't know why we need an extra research lab in here. It's a shame we can't swap that out for something else. You know what I mean? So you got one one floor for one thing and another floor for another thing. Yeah, looks like we've got an extra hab here now, people. Isn't that awesome? It's a double-decker ship. That's pretty much it. And now we've got loads more storage, so I can store up to 900 in here now, people, which is freaking insane, isn't it? Let's go into there. Yeah, so there we go, 278 mass now. I have got quite a lot of resources still in here, actually. I thought I'd sold it all, but obviously I haven't, which is probably a good thing then. Great. Okay, well, we've got a extra, extra stuff now. Nice. Okay, well, I, I might as well head on off. 
I guess I might as well head on off to my next plotted course. I guess. Well, actually, I was going to go to my outpost and see if I can put down any storage containers, wasn't I? So I'll go do that. Well, how do the jams? I'm back. Yes, well, I went and put down a storage container at my um, outpost. So that's all good. So we've got that going on. I've stowed everything away inside my ship. And now we're going to be scanning the moon called Chihuahua. Okay, so let's go on over. Let's let's go to jump into this space and we'll see how many resources this has. Okay, so let's set a course. Heck yes. And jump. Sweet. We're on our way there, people. Okay, well, we've arrived at Kated in the system. Okay. Hold on. Sounds like there's something going on. I need my headset. Then the greatest. I know that's grammatically impossible, but somehow you managed to do it. Oh, thank you, chum. Right, okay. Well, let's um go back into the old map of the doodle. Chikapow. Let's scan this sucker. I guess. Okay, it's only got three resources. This one shouldn't be too quick. Ah, well, shouldn't be too long, should it? So let's have a look, see. Frozen dunes. And I think it's just all frozen dunes. We'll go where we can kind of see all the resources in one place, which I think probably around where I am is probably a good spot, isn't it? Am I on the light side of the planet, though? Let's just come out of there. No, I'm not. So let's spin this around to the light side. And let's try that again. Let's see if we can find a nice little spot there. I think around there would probably be fairly good, wouldn't it? There we go, we'll go there. Ooh, what a lovely picture. I did not take that picture. Heck, no, I didn't. Ooh, we should get land in animation, so I won't hit stop. Awesome. I do love it when you touch down. On a planet, and you see the loading animation, you're like, what's it going to be, you know? Well, let's go on out. Okay, so this is quite a snowy type looking gap, isn't it? Alright, well, we haven't got much to scan. There you go, one resource down already. We found that in the ground. We'd head towards this outpost over here. Actually, is that a ship landing right now? I thought I could hear a ship landing. The S. Shall we go see if we can nick that ship? It looks freaking tiny. But you know what? Ship parts are quite expensive. So we'd head towards that and see what we can grab. There we go. That's two or three resources found already. I'm just finding them in the poxy ground. Argon. Okay, we need... H2O is the last one we need to find. Water, people. Keep going over this way. Oh look, there's the last resource. I just saw it over this over this dune. It's just there. Let's scan that. Oh, don't take off. I'm on my way. I'm trying to get there as quick as I can. Run. Come on. Should be able to see that ship. There it is there. It's a bit yellow. Looks like a space taxi. Well, we've managed to fully survey this planet. We're going to see if we can nick this ship. Because if I can nick that, I might be able to salvage some bits off of it. We'll just take it all apart. I've already scanned that. That's so cool. Okay. Running out of breath. What weapon have I got on me? Okay, that'll do. Oh, I need to buy some more ammo. I should have done that while I was in Jameson. I'm going to have to go back there and buy some ammo. All right, well, this this is, this ship looks a little bit shite, to be honest. But uh, we'll see how we get on. Hmm. Is there bad guys? This might be a good guy ship. We not, might not be able to nick it. I don't feel I don't know how Sarah's gonna feel about me nicking this ship. But let's let's have a look, see if I can or can't. I can. Space a raccoon. It's a spacer ship, not a pirate ship. I could get into a lot of trouble for nicking this. So I think we'll leave it be. I think we'll leave it be, but it's nice to take a look at it, isn't it? Alright, well I haven't got any pictures on this planet, so I'm gonna get some pictures. I'm gonna make my way back to the ship and I'll show you my pictures once I get back to the ship, people. 
Well, there we go. Jums. I've become liking the look of my ship. It looks a little bit disjointed. It looks like there's something missing there, doesn't it, really? But I don't think there's too much I can do about that right now. I'm, I might just save up and buy a brand new ship, or I might try nicking a ship. But as far as a starter ship goes, this should make it last for the amount of time that I'm doing the scanning. So I'm not really overly fussed about its aesthetics too much. I would I would like to be able to build a ship from scratch though. But that's gonna take a lot of a lot of moolah, isn't it? It really is. Anyway, I took some pictures. So I guess you better take a look at my pictures. Enjoy the pictures, people. Okay, picture time! Right, here's my first picture. Yes, it's of that yellow submarine type taxi looking ship that I was going to nick and then change my mind. And there I am, flying in the air on this majestic planet that I can't even remember the name. Is it Chihuahua or something like that? And there I am, gazing off into distance with my handsome mug. Yes, lovely. And there we are, approaching the ship and marvelling it from the outside. They're my pictures for this episode. I hope you like them, people. Right, there, people. So where are we going to be going next time? Let's go and hit on up and have a quick look-see, shall we? So we complete the 100 surveyed. Chawala. Okay. Chawala. Or Chawala. 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 Whatever. Okay, we've already done Zamka. I might go and do Hawley next time. It's got five on there and it might have points of interest, like traits. We'll see though, people, shan't we? Until next time, people, salute to Mondo. Goodbye, goodbye. And goodbye again.